progress. Hi. Stop right there. Stop. I can. Stop right there. Okay. Her tail. She locked me up for oh, it. Oh, wait, what? Yeah. I swear. Okay, don't take my face. You're just being detained right now. We fight. I know y'all not thinking we don't want to fight. Y'all think we don't want that fight? Y'all think we don't want that fight? Ooh. 5-1-A-Q. I have one female detained. Deputies grabbed the woman seen here, identified as 21-year-old Raquel Jones, along with a 16-year-old girl. After another deputy allegedly witnessed the pair bolting across the parking lot with two filled shopping carts. Four seven has one thing. Okay. Hey, right. 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 Do you have any weapons in it? No. Okay. What's your name? Rocky. Rocky. Rocky Balboa. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. My name is Brian. I'm so well, Sergeant Myers. What? What's going on? Somebody was in there fighting, and then they started being nasty with us. Like, we with these people, and now we like, all right, now if we walk out with our y'all going to be mad. Because you can even look at my pocket. I got a pocket full of money. Like, I, I'm not even. full of money? Yes. Okay. You can see it. Like, I was going to literally okay. pay for my stuff. But it was being rude to us. Like, we the ones who was fighting. Who is being rude to you know a nigga lying when they start talking about, oh, man, I got money, I don't need to steal. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the people in the store, like, I feel like that's profiling. Okay, well, they like, so well, you know all these guys, are you with them? We obviously, like we just pulled up, she was over there, and I seen, is, is you're with her, the other girl? No, I'm just with her, yeah. Right, so she was running across the park a lot, and the deputy said that you guys were involved, so... You're not under arrest right now, okay? Uh -huh. You're just detained because I don't want to run or fight with you or anything right. like that. I wasn't so, going to run or fight with y'all. I'm just very cooperative. Back with our underage suspect. It isn't long until a, let's just say, surprising connection between the two incidents appears out of the blue. Stop walking. Don't walk on my wrist. Where are the other two? Who? Who? I can't look at you because I need you to turn around. But I can't look at you because that's not right. I can't look at whatever. I have one female team for seven has one team. So this girl's 12 or what they say, 16. Starting them off young, man. Starting them off, yo. Ain't no reason. If y'all got money, ain't no reason y'all should be out here wilding out like this, man. Okay, can stop you walking. Can I finish what I'm doing first? What? I'm going to make sure that they don't get tighter on you. I need you to stop squatting. They, they good. Appreciate you know, it. But there's this fun thing that if you keep squirming, they're not blocked yet. Yeah. So nah, they can't show this criminal, man. This criminal's a minor, man. You got to keep him off the cam. Keep him off the rover. Oh, this is last year too, September 9th. They're gonna get tighter on that. That's what we're trying not to do. Oh, they can hurry up and put me in a car, like. You got home, because I ain't running on here, because I can't get out. Okay, you got home, you got tight. Here, you hurry up and put me in a car. You got anything on your phone? Quick, we sit here. Go to the entrance of the cemetery. What's on her, 4th Street there. Keep walking, keep walking. If they come out that way. Keep walking, keep walking. 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 Keep walking, you can take out the text if you want to. I can't keep it. Sure. Why, you want to give me back to me? Yes, yeah, so it's your property. He's cooperative. I'm going to be in the center of the cemetery. You have any idea on it? Yeah. The cemetery was no shirt. Do you have any? Is this person? Is this person with you? That's not on. That's right. Yeah? Nora Edwards, Victor Idenhart. Right. Oh. I'm in the car for me, please. I'm in the car for me, please. This one's going to be a problem when she get older. She hanging with the aunt. The aunt out here stealing. Got her out here stealing. She out here going at it with the, oh, this one's going to be a problem. We thought Carly was bad. The, whoever this young lady is right here, I hope. I hope someone guides her in the right direction because this could be bad for her.
later on in life. Hold on. Yeah, I got it. Watch me. Wait, this is my niece. Hold on. She yeah, only 16. Around. Not me. I didn't turn say- around. What do you mean turn around? Come money. over here, please. Right now. I didn't take her. 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 I never said you did. I need you to turn around and listen to me. Wait, for what? I came over here willingly to get my niece. Why okay. would I come over here if I did something? Don't put your hands on me, officer. You don't have my niece to say anything to me. Oh, the whole family gonna be a problem. I thought it was just the auntie and the niece. It's the other auntie too, and they got some R.I.P. R.I.P. This brother on the shirt. Oh man, it's about to be a field day. I need to talk to you. Oh, why are you trying to put me in here? This is my niece. Right. She's yeah, sixteen. Exactly. Because we're being told that there's other situations coming from dicks over here. I just fought somebody. Okay, right. That's <laughs> the other reason. So, so like, just someone. sit down over here for me, please. Yeah, I'm not getting put no hate. I'm grown. Oh, I just came over here for my niece. Now, She's 16. This is your niece? Uh, that's my niece. Oh, my okay. Who's this to? Yeah, girl, huh? Who's this to? Like that's her cousin. You heard that right. This unidentified woman who admits to being involved in that fight is apparently related to at least one of our shoplifting suspects. Let's continue. Who the is that? I thought that, that was us, and I was like, I can't. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> So the cousins, the cousin in handcuffs and then the 16 year old in the vehicle, they're cousins. But the auntie was fighting some other nigga on the other side of the parking lot. So they came out of dicks for stealing. The auntie was fighting a nigga on the other side of the parking lot. So the whole family was just up here and they didn't know that they were up here talking about them. They go, my niece over there getting put in the car after I got my ass whooped. What the fuck? <laughs> she, I'm the auntie, but that's her cousin. So this might be the cousin on her daddy's side. She talking about, girl, who you up here fighting? Who you over here arresting? Man, I love my people, man. I love my people. I ain't gonna lie to you. Talk to me. I'm gonna walk out my email. Uh -oh. Get the sign record. Get the sign record. Girl, Nene just called. I got a pocket full of money. Where is this? Nene just called. Serena. Nene just called. She left. Nene just called me and said, "Why the fuck you need to be arrested?" She just left in a car. Yeah, I don't know what car she got in. We fought. We fought. In, we fought in your in outside. So now she's telling she fought her niece. Wait, did they say they she fought her niece and the niece drove off? Oh my goodness. Where is this? Nene works in there. Nene Serena. Nene just called. She left. Nene just called me and said, "Why the fuck you need to be arrested?" She just left in a car. Yeah, I don't know what car she got in. We fought. We fought. In, we fought in your in outside the front okay. of the Hold on. Will you just do me a favor and sit down, please? So they were stealing out of dicks. The auntie was fighting in front of Coles. The other niece drove off and was like, "Hey, why is your other niece getting arrested?" So she was. Oh my goodness. I'm loving this. Look, this cop over here is like, "Wait a minute." How the fuck are all you niggas related? <laughs> this is the white guy. He's like, what? all these niggas is related. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, <laughs> they fighting in front of Coles. They were stealing from dicks. <laughs> oh, man. That's it. Everybody's under arrest. You got to take everybody in at this point. We got to figure this out. We're going straight to family court Monday morning, bright and early. Oh my God. I almost in. I'm not mad at y'all. I'm going to go out. That's what I'm saying. One of the girls that work there, she knows me. We work, that, we work at Wendy's together. She just called my he phone. His <laughs> he work at Wendy's together. So the girl at Coles that knows her got two jobs. She works at Kohl's and she works at Wendy's. She didn't came up here and got the fighting in front of the store. And now she's bringing a friend that, oh my goodness. If I'm the friend that worked at Kohl's, I'm like, bitch, don't be mentioning my name to the goddamn police. Talk about we work together. We don't know each other, nigga. Yeah, no one's under us. Okay. We're just detaining people because we're trying to figure out what went up. Oh, okay. Okay. So no one's under arrest right now. Okay. So get detained. Just like. Hold up, hold up. Everybody calm down. I put her in there because you were coming right behind me and that. Oh, that's it was just me. That's no, no, no I know. But you were coming up quick on me and that's why I was nervous for a second. Two, go look at my pocket. I got a pocket full of money. I just don't like when people be funny towards me and trying to discriminate me. So I'm like. And what's going on with the money? Discriminate. Nothing. I was what, about what to buy my stuff. Bro, so, so, they was being funny thinking what? that we was with you. That's why I'm not okay. 
Yes. So, 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 hey, five to seven one. Can you go ahead with the description of the other two for six one? Hey, everybody. We're going to get you right back to that body cam in just a minute. But before we do, I have a question for you. What do a lot of the body? Man, we don't give a damn about this advertising. We want to see what these cousins and aunties got going on. Hey, what did he say in Black Panther? Hey, auntie. <laughs> if you're injured, you can easily start a clinic. Oh, man, this is good right here. You can't make this up, babe. Yeah, I'm going to have to put this in my book. I'm going to have to write up a story like this. Was people fighting in the entrance? Entrance? Because she, and, she and kept right calling me out. Okay. Like, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You gotta let me talk, okay? People Other fighting in front of decks. Okay, we come pulling in. All right, and I seen her. She was running this way, and then you were running. You weren't running, but you were running. walking across. But she was running, so we just grabbed them. We don't know what's going on. We don't know if he's been been hurt. We don't know. If maybe it was a robbery. We have no idea. A All robbery. Right, so we just detained people. No one's under arrest right now. All right, so who fought with who? I didn't know that he was, they was, that was even them in the store. I didn't even see them in the store. But I was, I'm going in the shop for my niece. And then the Soraya, who keep calling my job. I done called the police too. Wendy's a couple times. She called my job. So Soraya be coming to Wendy's harassing the auntie. And the auntie didn't call the police two times. So we got to find this B Soraya. Order stuff. Come to the window. Yeah. I love Wendy's. She come to my job. Throw, she threw the window at me when I opened the thing. I done caught police three times. Okay. The thing, I said, where the daughter? Oh, so. Wait, wait, wait. This is whose daughter? Hey, this is it. Hey, this is, look, the white cop, he trying to defuse the situation. Like, all right, look, I like Wendy's. But Soraya has been ordering shit from Wendy's. So the auntie came up to Coles and fought this B Soraya. Because when Soraya would go in there, she would get the little milkshake from Wendy's, but then she would throw it in the window. So she'd been fucking with Auntie for a while. Auntie done called the police twice. Cuz oh, she knows about Soraya. You talking about that same bitch that been coming up to Wendy's? She talking about, yeah, this is such and such daughter. So I'm gonna try to see whose daughter it is. And we're gonna look up who this guy is. This is good right here. This is good, right? This is good television. She threw the window at me when I opened the thing. I done called police three times. The same, I said, where the other daughter? Oh, so I'm in there. I see her. I don't talk I'm like, I should smack this, right? And she looking at me. She's like, stop smacking. So I said, come smack me. Uh oh. So I, I mean, I beat her mother in the air. Okay. Yeah, okay. We need off. Yeah, we both, we both left. Okay. We fought outside the cold. So I said, I, I chased that. I beat her out okay. again. You want anything done about the fighting? Are you? No. So I, mean, I, I finally caught it. Outside of work. So I don't kill up no more. I, but you did it. Yeah. You did it, right? But somebody okay. just called me okay. and said, One other issue. Then you grab the Gatorade on your way out. That was at Miss Soraya, that boo girl shot on. Oh, she didn't told on. So Soraya, Soraya was in there fighting. Auntie told me I slapped the fuck out of you, bitch. She told me, well, come slap me then, bitch. So she went over there and slapped the bitch. Now the bitches is in here fighting. Now, I'm not calling either one of them a bitch. I'm just using the terminology that they using to try to describe the situation. Now they in here scrapping. Now you know old girl that worked at Coles, she worked with her over at Wendy. So she over there, yeah, get her auntie, yeah, yeah, yeah. So they in here fighting. Whoop, whoop. Police is getting called whole time. They ain't even know Cuzzo and Niece is getting arrested for shoplifting forty five hundred dollars. But when Soraya dips about, that bitch grabs a Gatorade. So Auntie tells the police that Soraya stole a Gatorade on the way out because when you get dehydrated, the only way you can replenish those electrolytes, you gotta have a Gatorade, preferably red, maybe yellow, or maybe blue. But we're not sure what Gatorade she grabbed. But we can confirm that Auntie said the B Soraya grabbed the Gatorade on the way out. Okay, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. We're getting. Listen, I drink Gatorade. Powerade is actually better for you because Powerade has less sugar. But Gatorade will work. Gatorade will work. So Auntie, okay. After a fight, you do need to replenish. Yeah, fuck, that's how he fought outside the calls. I said, I said, I started chasing him. I said, I'm going to beat y'all again. I tell you what, this is what we're going to do, okay? We got to get some information. We still got to go talk to the people like this, okay? 547173. You were involved. No, I wasn't involved. We're not involved in the same thing. Oh, basically, I was. Oh, look at Aunt. Look, 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 look. Aunt said all I was doing was fighting.
we are not involved in the same thing. So auntie must know that Cuzzo and her niece been stealing because she's like, oh, no, we ain't in the same thing. What same thing we talking about? We ain't even told you what they got going on. She's like, oh, hell no, nah, I ain't got nothing to do with that. I did a little fighting. That B Sharia, that motherfucker kept coming to my job. I slapped the fuck out that B. She stole a Gatorade. I'm about to go home, but I don't know what they got going on. But that's two separate cases right there, Judge. I mean, uh, sir, officer, I don't want nothing to do with what they got going on. You got to go tap on the window. Hey, you be all right. I'm going to tell your mom they got you down at the precinct, all right? <laughs> so auntie said, I don't have nothing to do with what the fuck they got going on. Got to get some information. We still got to go talk to the people. Okay. Five, four, so seven, you were involved. Seven, you were involved. No, I was not. Like we're not involved in the same until, thing. Oh, basically, I was an involved because they tried to, yeah, and they was basically trying to fight me with them. Like, come on now. Don't be rude to us. Like, I was trying to you guys want to interrupt me because no, I don't know. Is it because I don't no. have hair? Is that what this no. is all They were both free. That's how much no, it costs. I mean, this, is, this is the thing I'm struggling with, okay? My child would be mad too. Somebody say hey, hey, hey. I give on some real shit. I give this white cop, I give him all the credit in the world because this, like, let's be real, this is some ignorant shit going on right now. But he's not overly aggressive. He's actually trying to help them out. Like, wait, look, let's just try to figure it out. So I give him credit for that. Not all cops are bad cops. Now you hear the niece in the car talking about how they get to kick it out there. I'm I'm 16. Why I'm in here? Shut up, fucking criminal. Your your cousin over here got a pocket full of money. We ain't find no money on you, you little crook. <laughs> This is good. I like this one. Yeah, we're, we're going to drive back over there and sort this out, okay? So why don't you guys go and we're going to drive back over and sort this out. You want to ride over or you want to walk off? I'm going to walk over We got to get your information, all right? Uh-uh. Well, who are you? Uh-uh. What do you mean, uh-uh? Well, I'm going to get no charge for me from them. They probably, they probably uh, have well, no, no, no. So here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? Now, I fight them. I'll be dead. Here's the thing, right? Yeah, now, your king. It's called a mutual okay. cabal. Obviously, she left. She don't want nothing done. You don't want nothing done. No, I want to put charges on her. Okay, so it's harassment. And just give you a heads up, she can do the same thing on you. Good. But it's, it's a mutual cabal. You, 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 you ain't going to jail. Deputies nah. decide to head over to the Dick's Sporting Goods store where both incidents happened to try to straighten out what exactly is going on here. Now, nah, Belicious, this is different. Uh, Carly Russell was before this, but then this is a family affair here. We got an aunt fighting in front of Coles. We got two cousins allegedly stealing from Dick's. And now we're about to go over to Dick's and figure out who was sticking their hands in the Dick's store stealing shit. But not before Raquel tries to talk her way out of it. We're just going around the corner. We're going to figure this all out. Sooner. Yeah. So but child, know if we have harassment on both sides, no one wants anything. That one's all set. We'll we see. Got a different what different? Well, what? They both walked out with two large cards that I witnessed right in front of me. And okay. You two did? Yes, I you just told you why I did it. Come on, let's go. <laughs> but they discriminated us. That's wrong. That's wrong. We wasn't even really going to take this stuff. We just was going to do that and just we, we, was, we came here in an Uber. Where's all the stuff? It's right here in front of the store. But we seen Chuck coming. We didn't even know the cop. We was like, this. <laughs> Well, of course cops got to come. What do you think so? No, happen? I didn't know. No, we didn't know that y'all was coming or anything. We just thought it was like a rough communication. And that's wrong. Like, don't come up to us because we black. Like, I'm not I, No, you. don't you go there with me. No, no not you. That ain't no, how I'm I not, roll. Not you. Okay. Definitely not you. I'm talking okay. about them. Like, that's like somebody, like, say if you was my color and they see somebody else my color walking in. And they are going to fight it. First of all, I didn't even see the people. They walked up to us like, oh, are you guys with them and stuff like that? And I'm like, no. Oh, do you know them? Like, why are you asking me all of this stuff? Basically, like, you trying to force me to know. I do know her. That's like, Come yeah. to find out, you do know her. Yeah, I do. But I didn't know that that was them. But don't come up to us because we black. And that's basically profiling. Like, I could have literally opened my phone and recorded y'all. It probably Sorry. would have been easier than stealing something, right? Yeah. In hindsight. <laughs> hey, I commend this cop. Did y'all see? Did y'all see how he got her to admit that she stole? He just hit her with the okey doke. That's why you don't talk to the police. She admitted on camera that she stole. Watch this. Stuff. Basically, like you trying to force me to know. I do know her. That's like, oh, come yeah. to find out you do know yeah, her. Yeah, I do. But I didn't know that that was them. But don't come up to us because we black and that's basically profiling. Like I could have literally opened my phone and recorded y'all. It probably so, would have been easier than stealing something, right? Yeah. 
In but hindsight? He wasn't even going to really steal it. We just did that to be funny to me. I could have pulled my phone out and got the recording. He said that would have been easier than stealing, right? She's going to say, yeah, but we wasn't really stealing. We were just playing with him. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Wow. They got all the smart answers until it's time to goddamn really answer the real questions. The easiest question. It would have been easier than stealing. Oh, we weren't stealing. Or just shut the hell up. We in an Uber. All right. All right. In the other patrol car, the unidentified teenage suspect has a few questions for the deputy. That's why they ran. Hey, what's, what's up? Thank you, guys. You didn't get the stuff back. You were exiting the car. You looked right and you saw me. But yeah, but they got a stuff back. I promise you, two Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You still stole it. Yeah, so I'm gonna get charged, right? Yep. The group arrives to the store. I don't care about a charge. One deputy oh my tries God. to get to the bottom of what happened. Hey, what happened Hi. here? All right. Hey, so do you know where your car is? Is that your car? What car? The red car. What red car? I got a white car. You have a white car? That's how you got here? Mm-hmm. My car out here in the parking lot, though. Part of it is? Okay. Did your person that you just don't get along with, was she in a red car? I don't know what car that goes out there. Okay. All right. Why is the no, aunt here? Something. I would have went home. We were actually different matters. So it just was a very big coincidence and oh, good timing, I guess. Okay. Um, so we have the other two. This is like family of them. Um, Not of the one. Uh, yeah, the no, family. we're talking about the two that they're, we're going to be talking about. Um, so wait, the one you fought is your family? No, no the little oh. girl with the head. <laughs> First of all, I'm not talking to no dicks employee. Like, nigga, don't ask me no fucking question. You talk to the police. And the aunt shouldn't even be in here. You just got in trouble for fighting. God. The two with a larceny relation. So, um, was she involved in anyway? Um, I didn't see her involved okay. in any I didn't of the either, theft. so that's what I just want to make sure. In the theft, no, but Perfect. a fight, yes. Yeah, we, have, we already got all that. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we're good with that. Yes. Um, do you guys have a receipt, or have you guys had time to like go through all that? I don't know. Um, no, but I can do that quickly. Okay. Yeah. Do you want that's... me to do that right now? Oh, and yeah. get that done? Yeah, that, I'd appreciate it. Yeah. The deputy mentioned a red car that she reportedly witnessed all four of the women in hours earlier, fighting on the side of the road. Oh, it just gets worse and worse. So they said a couple of hours earlier, all four of them were in the same car together. So they came up because there's there's no coincidence that all four of them showed up to Dick's and to motherfucking Cole. They probably it was four people, right? They probably said we're gonna go in groups. You two go into Dick's, still with y'all can still. We're gonna go into Cole's because I know old girl over there, and she ain't really gonna ask no questions. So it was a it was a four-person team, but we gonna split up into two and two. Now, when they were over there stealing, that B. Soraya showed up. And we don't fuck with that B. Soraya. She be coming to Wendy's harassing us. So that B. Soraya came in there on our turf in Coles and started talking shit. So Auntie said, I gotta slap this B, which threw off us getting $4,500 worth of shit from Coles. Wow. Cuzzo and niece got $4,500 over here at Dick's. Oh, my goodness. So they came up uh, allegedly an hour ago. Four of them were in the vehicle. I don't know if it was these three plus Soraya. Maybe Soraya was the fourth person and they got into it at Coles and they got to fighting. What if Soraya was no, because she said her car was the white car. So Cuzzo and the niece, they came up here with someone else in the red car, which two other people were in that car. Because she said she had the white car. So wait, the cuzzo in the knee, they, what? We got to get to the bottom of this. This is, we need all, we need all the footage. We need cold security footage. We need to see the fight. We need to see if auntie actually won. We need to see who stole the Gatorade. We need to see what products were stolen from cuzzo in the knees. This is, now, this is a good body cam here. This is the gift that keeps on giving. Deputies question the woman when things get a little confusing. Basically, this whole thing started when she, me and her messed with the same dude. Oh. We, we, she, we got into, she texted my phone while she was with him, I guess, asking 
Why well, I'm texting him all this stuff? And I said, girl, as you can see why we texting him. You see all the messages. So yeah. I'm not like no delusional out here. So she told me she gonna snap when she see me. Mind you, she know I worked that because she was cool with my sister. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So they going that over a nigga. Auntie holding it down. Like, you know why I'm texting this nigga. That nigga Moby laying it down. That nigga Moby applying the pipe. You know why I'm texting him. She's like, don't you be texting my nigga. I'm going to slap you when I see you. So that's where the slap you when I see you happen at Coles because Soraya, that B, she already been coming to Wendy's harassing. So it was really on site for this B, Soraya. So Soraya was standing on business. She wasn't just in the text message just talking about, I'm going to slap you when I see you. Soraya seen her and got the slap. Oh, okay. This is, we're getting somewhere. After she did all that on Facebook with lie about me, all this, my sister said something to her. She said, Oh, they she got on the Facebook. You know it's real when you beefing with a nigga on Facebook live. That B Saray was on Facebook. I'ma slap that bitch, Auntie. It is what it is. And then Auntie's sister said something to Saray about oh, this is this is good here. This is good here. My sister baby. My sister be having her kids and all that. Okay. So she know where I was. So wait, the sister be watching Soraya's babies? What the fuck? Oh my goodness. So the sister is watching Soraya or Soraya, whatever the fuck her name is. She be the sister be watching the babies. And these two are beefing over a nigga. Oh my God. This I'm telling you, this is the gift that keeps on giving here. Let me make sure that's what she said. The sister be watching the kids. Girl, as you can see why we text him. You see all the messages. So yeah. I'm not like no delusion out here. So she talking, she gonna snap when she see me. Mind you, she know I work at Women's because she was cool with my sister. Mm -hmm. After she did all that on Facebook with life about me, all that my sister said something to her. She said, my sister baby. My sister be having her kids and all that. Oh, she so did. she know where I work. She came to my job. She threw a drink on me. Mm. I let it slide. No, I let it slide. She did it again. I, I made it my mission. Whenever I, wherever I catch her at, she worked at Home Depot. I said, wherever I catch her, I beat her. It's on site, nigga. I, I saved my sister's job. Where that dunk came, mm -hmm. and I came over here, so I was shopping for my sister baby. I saw that I'm on the phone, like asked my friend, like shots met with bitch now or later. I said we can fight outside. Ooh. outside fight, no matter where it's at, you're gonna get your she went in her mouth in the store, put her stuff down, keep saying fuck my sister baby, all the time. She came on me, not you know the store. Mm, right give by me the door. Okay. It's true. I took out. I stripped it. She took it out of clothes. And you're mm. driving a white car? A white Jeep. A white Jeep? Mm hmm. Which car? Which Jeep is yours? My friend's phone got my car. Okay. So you have your friend's car? No, it's my car, but my friend is driving my car. Right now? Mm hmm. Okay. She's supposed to come she pick you up. She's going to pick up my sister up. Okay. She, was she coming to pick you up right now? Yeah, she picked my sister up first. We, we was here together. Yeah, I'm just saying, like, how are you gonna get home from all this? Oh, I'm gonna get home. She's gonna pick, come back and pick me up. Okay. She picked my sister to bring her here. Okay. The woman tells deputies her sister, who's supposedly driving a white Jeep, is expected to pick her up. Keep that in mind for later. Let's mm -hmm. jump ahead when the 16 year old reveals another important detail that starts to unravel the woman's story. Let's hear it. Like I said, we're just seeing people stretching and running and we're just trying to figure out everything. And plus, we knew that you, I knew that you guys were all just fighting on the side of the road coming here. And I was trying to find you. Oh, so she was involved in the fighting too. So Cuzzo and the niece were involved in the fighting before even getting here, which is where we got that hour before we seen all of them in the car together on the side of the road fighting. Oh, 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 oh yeah, this is good. Car. Here. And then I got another fight complaint. That's the only reason you guys get caught. Because you guys can't keep your hands off each other. Why'd you guys get into a fight? We was really that, well, when me and her, we was just fighting. We was playing on the side of the road. Why are you guys on the side of the road? Because we started with here and we started with some of these stuff over there. That's when we had caught each other. And I was like, who? And I thought, like, I had put the car over. But she had dropped us off and she left. Yeah, because they said that you guys were slapping around. But then she said that your aunt got out and was like, all right, I'm done with this. And she was like, I'm going to put a kibosh to it all. <laughs> your aunt looked like she was not messing around. Soon after the teen has read her rights, she suddenly has a different story that is quickly interrupted. Let's listen in. Now that I have advised you of your rights, are you willing to answer my questions? Okay. Can you go to 518? I have questions in regarding how you got here. Sorry. What car were you? Is your cell available for the FP Sergeant? I don't remember. No, no, I didn't remember. I got it. You got it. Where you call her mom? What's that? Well, you have to call her mom. Do I have somebody to call her mom? Ask the to call her mom. Not right now. Not, well, 
So the niece is about to give us all the information because this cop is about to find out what vehicle she rode in. Now, she's a minor. I don't know what the age of consent is in New York. Or like, I think you still got to be 18 to talk to the police by yourself. But she's about to give up the information. Now, the aunt knows that this niece can't shut her mouth up because she said that she was fighting on the side of the road because they were playing around. Now, the aunt says that her white Jeep, the friend got in, is about to pick up the sister who the sister used to babysit Soraya, that B that threw the damn drink on auntie. We need to find out who this Soraya B is, and we need to find that fucking Facebook Live that she was on. I want to see how reckless she was talking. Don't need her to go to no parent. What's up? She don't need to go to no parent. To call a parent right now? Because she don't need to go with a parent? I'm sorry. I literally can't. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sick. That's okay. I'm saying, like, she don't need to go with a parent or nothing? Like, she don't need her parent? So, at this time, no. Okay. Because we're still trying to figure out everything over here. The deputy gets in the patrol car and continues to talk to the teen when, guess who, decides she has Auntie. even more to say. Take a look. Who would be your parent guardian? Is she in service? Was she in play models? Yeah. Is she in phone calls like this often? Not done. Are we still not done? Is it not done? No, they have two full cards to process. So we can charge for even loading. They had two fucking full carts of fucking shit. Well, it's forty five hundred dollars. Damn, what were they stealing in there? Baseball bats? Fucking hockey gear? He wasn't just stealing clothes. Hold on, sir. Hold on, sir. What's up? Hold on, I'll tell you back. I'll take a picture of her right now. I gotta get home. Okay, well. You're affiliated with all of us, so I gotta sit tight with us. Wait, what you mean affiliated with all of it? This is your niece, right? Yeah, like you probably don't wanna leave her alone. You said you were waiting for a ride anyway, she's not here. What's that mean, though? Where are you gonna go? I can leave, though. I'm just saying, like. Well, you're saying to hurry up, and you're that? telling me that you're telling me you're not involved, so. So what? <laughs> you're telling me to hurry up when you're also telling me that you're not involved. I just want to talk to this girl stole my wallet. Who stole your wallet? Wallet? Yes. That's never been mentioned at all. You can ask them in the store and tell them that. Okay, the people in the store aren't me. This is the first time we're hearing about this. So what, what do you, how did she steal your wallet? I don't know. I literally went, before that even, before that, them bitches even left, I came back in there and I, I went and I asked, I said, did y'all see a white wallet in here? Okay. And it was like, no, no. So I, I kept as I looked to like, take a search for you were um, standing there mm -hmm. before you fought. I went over there, it wasn't me. Okay. So that, and okay. that's my I'm you think that's a big deal? Over there. I saw y'all pulling over there, so I came over there. You understand that like if somebody steals your property, like that's a charge, right? That's something you generally would tell to the police? I'm confused on like what you're trying to get at. Like, I'm not like you're trying to get smart me or nothing like. No, I'm being serious. Like that's kind of a big deal if you think somebody stole your wallet. That's something that we would make an arrest off of if we can prove that and assist you. Okay. Is that something that you're looking for? I have no yeah, idea what's going wallet. on right now. All my stuff in it. Okay. Well, earlier you were frustrated about getting a harassment charge and. That's something else that I need video footage for. So again, we've got like three different cases here now. Is what you're telling me. Not just so now who are you calling? The My sister. Person with the Jeep? Huh? Person with the Jeep? Yeah. All right. So you're going to figure that out? Yeah. Okay. Moments later, a store employee emerges with the total of the stolen merchandise. There we go. $4,546 worth of... I don't know if you want all of this. I can redo it. Is this just every, this is every item and how much it costs with the barcodes. Yep. So it's up to you. Let me see. $75, $75, $75, $48. Then they was in here, right? What, they, they were still in jerseys and t-shirts. What the hell were they still in here? $4,500. Can 
Do you want this? Yeah. Do you want sure. it? Thirty dollars, eighteen dollars, thirty, twenty-five, thirty, forty-five, thirty, seventy. Damn, these motherfuckers wasn't even trying to be discreet with it. They just had baskets full of shit. They didn't think that they was gonna get out of here with two carts full of fucking forty five hundred dollars worth of shit though. I'm thinking it's about to be maybe like seven or eight like huge pieces or something, but it looked like they were just stealing t shirts, helm like what what were they stealing? They need to show us what was in that cart though. That's what I want to see. The employee reveals the suspects made off with over $4,000 worth of items. One deputy heads inside with the employees who witness the scene and get a chance to talk in private. Let's see what they have to say. Oh, damn. Look, it's sweaters, it's hoodies. Oh, where they think they was going to get away with this? Look, man, it's hoodies and shit in here. Where do they think they was about to do with all of this? Sell it on fucking Facebook Marketplace? Say. So, do you think that other female was involved? I, it's hard to tell because, um, I mean, I have the security footage because they, um, they got like a big... Did they all enter at the same time? I didn't see them come in. She called me out from the back office. So, in. Um, I feel like that woman that you're speaking of, I feel like she may have walked in after the rest of them did, but pretty much... Okay. So like, what time did they walk in? Did she purchase stuff? No. No. Not one thing, but, and she didn't steal anything either. And at first, you know what I thought? They were doing like, like the whole decoy thing yeah. because the two were fighting so that the other ones can fill their carts. And I kept saying, I go, there's going to be something up here. I said, she's, yeah. she's taking like, mounds and like stuff and throwing it in. Yeah. Um, at their exit time, that was 6 right. yeah, yeah. So, so I would start at 6 30. I'd start at 6 30. I call that. Six thirty nine. Five four seven. Yeah, so definitely size six. Are we all what up, NL? Oh. Affirmative. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. We're gonna we're gonna call it. Right, get around right Uber. Yeah. Dog, they got three fucking full carts, and I'm talking about mounds of shit. So they were pulling a distraction. That B Soraya may have been a part of it because they were fighting, but. Uh, they were pulling a distraction on us. Copy, thank you. Yeah, we, we're just trying to make sure. She She's saying a few different things. Um, I had an accident, an incident, I should say, um, within the last 20 minutes that gave us the same exact description of four women. Yep. I saw one, two, and nine, six. They were all in a red Lawrence car. And Tori were just driving them. Yeah. Black yeah. Mercedes, correct? And I think this car is going to be parked for the Home Depot because apparently this I other person... Works for Home Depot, she's telling me. Okay. And apparently I got yeah, wind that out. she's hiding in a okay. shed currently. That's, 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 you know. Let us see oh. this footage, man. I'm blocked this shit. Yeah, it just, it looked fishy to me. Like, yeah. Because I had said, guys, I think this is all going to be like, this is all the same, like, scenario. Like, yeah. we're all together. They are all affiliated. They're, we just so, don't know, like, what the actual situation is from it. Um, because they were... Without stealing anything, just fighting in the grass slash the road on Grand Ave twenty minutes before this, like on the other side of town, oh. the county line. So I was already in route. And, like, and it was the same. It's the same two. Same four. So same four. They're all associated, but they're claiming like one took a new one, one came this way, one's in a white jeep, one's in a. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. So that is very fishy. Back with the other deputy, the woman insists someone talked to the teen's mother when her ride shows up. Keep in mind who the woman reportedly told deputies was picking her up and what kind of car. Hang on one minute, okay? He said, hang on, but we're about to leave. We're going to hurry up. I got to go home. I got to go to work. Yep, I know where that is. Yep, thank you. Blanchard. Okay. Call him. All right. Give the ages. Mine's the other girl's 21. Okay. Okay. And they want... Yes. I just, I know, they know you were saying, they, uh, they said, said that. I'm not sure. Just to me, girl. What's that? Still not sure how what? this is what, how this Tell is going to play out. Her. Huh? Tell me how speak, to her. Speak with who? This is her mother. Okay. Go, go do your She want to know what's going on. 21? There. Huh? You're right. Hold on. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Be right here. Oh, that's my Uber. Make it short, please. Make it, huh? I'm talking to her. Make it short, girl. Hi. Hello? Who, 
Who's, who's, my name's Sergeant Myers of the Sheriff's Office. Who's this? Clearly, the woman's ride is not a white Jeep, and she just told the deputy her Uber just arrived. But that doesn't exactly add up with her earlier story. Back with Raquel, deputies decide it's time to take our suspects to the station. We both gotta go to the station. Yeah. Lena, head this way, okay? This way. Yeah, just so I see the I got it. So, yeah, she's under arrest, too. I hope you don't got to go to jail. I'm about to go to jail, son. Please. Oh, not. They always talking about their kids when it's time to go to jail. Where were your kids at when you had $4,500 worth of sweaters and hoodies? Matter of fact, if y'all got any of those hoodies or anything, holla at your Well, let me not say that. I don't want to buy stolen goods. So after you pay your restitution, bring me over some of those hoodies. XL. Can you give me your landline? I didn't get your hair, did you? No, See, that's what I'm so sure. afraid of. Okay. Once at the sheriff's office station, the 16-year-old was issued an appearance ticket and later released to her aunt, the same woman from this incident, a short time later. Raquel Jones was booked for larceny and spent the night in jail. Her case remains open. Oh, God. Yeah. Like, sit up in here? No, you're not Well, the whole family was involved in some bullshit. <laughs> Auntie left everyone out to, to take the charges by herself. But it looks like they were all in this together. Now, they were all fighting earlier. And just as I suspected, so the auntie walked in a little bit later. Kendall said that they were probably using the wallet as a distraction. But there's no way they were getting out of Dick Sporting Good with three full baskets of sweaters and hoodies. The auntie was the leader. She had them go in and do it because they were younger. The niece, definitely nothing's going to happen to her. They didn't even mention what happened to the 16-year-old. Because she probably ended up getting released. I mean, they sent her down there, but the 21 year old got larceny, but it was just a, you know, say in the order. Of... That was some wild shit, though. I thought we was going to have to go find this, this B Soraya so we can go fight her. Not me. I was just going to watch. But I wanted to find out what the hell was going on with her because she done threw a drink on Auntie two times. And all of this is over fucking around with me. Well, that was a good one there, though, because it just every time we looked up, it was a whole nother story. There was a whole new character. And then we started getting the backstory. So they got a police call an hour earlier. Hey, there's some girls on the side of the road fighting. Carly Russell may have been the one that set this up. Interesting. I like that one. That was a good one there. That was a good one, Coach Jones. That was a good one. But $4,500, that's a lot of shit to be stealing, especially like in small ticket items. $70 is the most. Yeah, it better than me. I would have been, I'm like, hey, on, I'm good on that. I don't feel like stealing today. <laughs> All right, we got one more body cam. I'm not going to stop it as much because I doubt it's going to be as good. But wait, where's it at? Oh, it didn't finish. Oh, I could just bring it up on YouTube. Hold on. Y'all think the uh the young girl should be charged too, or they should just let her go? Just let her get on out of here. <laughs> 